Yo, what is good? My anime people. You getting sick of me in this green light? I apologize. Get me some people to work for me, and I'll be out of here always on the game or in better scenery. That being said, though, Tokyo Revengers. Best goaded. 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 This cliffhanger, though. Not a fan. You could at least said, Bow, season two. Would it be back? Bow. We back. Season yeah, Sorry. Um, but this ending is... It's not as hard. It doesn't hurt my heart nearly as much as them getting taken out in the past and not really getting a future anymore. Um, because... There's no implications of the rules of his abilities. That's the point that is getting scary. That's where you don't know if he can go back to even further and re literally restart, right? Instead of doing the things that he did in the first time in the first episodes or whatever, do we, can he go that far back? Which I, it feels like he can't. And if he can, what are... Uh, the ways to getting there and I think this might answer that question but at the same time uh, I feel like this is just a big misleading scene him getting shot and probably someone else is going to come in there and do something maybe because last time I checked it's not hard to read the room and know who has some bad blood against each other and to let them be gone as long as they were without any sound, and supposedly this building is like the same building, they should, someone should be able to get there. Yeah. The crazy thing is the future that this is. Mikey's, Mikey's gone missing. Draken has been executed. And I'm just sitting here like, bruh. You thought this future was it. He's literally dressed like Baji. He's he's Baji clone right now. And he looks more swaggy than he's ever looked before. Unfortunately, this life is terrible. It's a worse outcome with him being in a lavish life. Because not only is he there, his vice captain has been attacking inviting the hand of someone in Toma who isn't going to let that fly in the slightest and we see what he does very quickly. I thought he was one that doesn't get his hands dirty. I was wrong. He's complete scum. He is complete scumbag. So good to know and good to know how dangerous he is because this man is pulling out guns and popping heads. I don't think, um, you know, watching someone get stabbed with a knife is really anything to him. Not to mention, he is the one person who was actually on the rooftop when they were talking about time travel. And it's still been sitting with me this whole time. When he asked, who, like, what are you? Like, what, who are you? Or like, what are you? And that, that right there made me feel like he's talking about that time, knowing that he could be going back in time, knowing that. Um, you know, maybe he had some of these emotions of a different timeline and they carried over. I don't know. But what I do know is this season finale, this whole entire show was a banger. Even though our main character probably cried every single episode, I have so much respect for this character and I want to see going forward just exactly what the heck is going to go on. Oh, but yeah. Awesome stuff, man. This this is a season to watch. Please watch this show. If that isn't any reason, watch it for Mikey, the man, the legend who can beat up people thir like 13 years his age. If, you know, if we really put him in a situation, he could probably do it. Draken, who is one of the most humble and heartfelt, member but one of the most deadly at the same time 
and so many more members are growing on me but unfortunately there's always an end where all of them could be missing and that is kind of the new issue i have with the show who's gonna make it who's going to be big in the future and what is it that will have the perfect outcome for everybody what is a perfect outcome in this situation right is there a perfect outcome or is it just saving the sister and that's it which we didn't hear anything about did we <laughs> Well, that being said, everybody, I hope you have an amazing day, night, evening, whatever the case may be when you're watching. I'm your boy, Yami G, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Peace.